I want to turn now to one of the most critical areas of social need in Jamaica. And that is the issue of affordable housing. In this area, our passion and our purpose is also clear. We, the next People's National Party government, is going to ensure that a path is set out in the law to facilitate the transformation of the 700,000 squatters in the country from the squatting to become proud homeowners in Jamaica. All across Jamaica, we see more and more communities with people living on the edge. Edge of a gully bank, cut up on a hillside, no road. Sometimes you can't go to a yard unless you walk on the side of a gully wall where not even big like this podium here. Rain or shine. That's how you get to a yard. It is a shame. It is a blot. It is a scar on the landscape of our country. Some of these people have been living on the land for decades. Whether in town, Mobe, Maypen, Ocheria, Savlamar, all over the country. Some have been there, see them children born, grandchildren come, set up business there, and yet every single day they live with the uncertainty, no, the fear that someone can come and tell them, come up, come off, you don't have no place here. You cannot build a national spirit if people feel that they don't have a place place in the land of their birth by right. Some people come into possession of family land but don't have a title. They come into possession of bauxite lands. In some cases, the land has been subdivided and passed on, but they still don't have the paper. In almost every respect, these people have dominion over the land in a manner consistent with ownership, but they don't have no paper and title to the land.